This dialogue in Port Harcourt, the River State Capital, affords multi-stakeholders in the operation of the Petroleum Industry Act the opportunity to present reports and review some of the challenges related to the takeoff of the initiative. This lawmaker wants host communities to utilize the opportunities which the PIA provides. Well, I would say it's uh, quite slow, very, very slow. It's a um, work in progress, uh, but I think just like we have rightly said here, with a lot more of uh, uh, getting the people to understand what it is, then we'll get better. Also, the companies need to also up their game. NUPRC is doing well. We believe they can do better. Chairman of the Bridges Project, the multi-stakeholder platform established to ensure effective operations of the PIA and host communities, speaks on some challenges being encountered. I really think we need to make an effort to get our people to understand what the PIA is all about. We need to understand the modalities for implementing it. You know, what are the different roles? If we create greater awareness amongst the people, there will be less beefing. A lot of times, you know, the beefing is because of wrong information that is being provided to people. Some NGOs are calling for more awareness on the PIA while urging oil producing communities to speak out on reforms that they want. This representative of the Ford Foundation reveals why his platform chose to fund the initiative. As has been said today, this is a pioneer collaborative platform for discussions to fill those gaps, create awareness, build capacity so that community dwellers can take their destiny in their hands and begin to implement the PIA. And regulator can be aware of issues and concerns and people can partner together to get this to this point. So today we are just showing the first round of findings, report about what has transpired in the last one year of six quarterly meetings of this multi-stakeholder platform of 30 people from the community trust, from civil society organizations, from government and the private sector, including the oil and gas communities. Our work is aimed at reducing inequalities um, all over the world, and particularly in the, where natural resource extraction, particularly oil and gas and mining takes place uh, to ensure that um, the extraction benefits the country and particularly the, the communities uh, whose lives and livelihood are impacted the status report presented at the dialogue outlines the activities of the Bridges Project in the Niger Delta region, which aims to foster cooperation among different stakeholders so as to ensure the effective implementation of the PIA in five Niger Delta states of Delta, Bayersa, Rivers, Akwaibon, and Ondo. From Port Harcourt, it's Andy Omano Omano, Arise News.